hello guys welcome back to my channel so today we're going to make this very cute uh, love bunny so what you're gonna need is uh, this crochet hook I used uh, 3.5 millimeters and also you're gonna need two kinds of yarn one for the heart and one for the main body so let's get started Okay, so we're going to start with the head and uh, we're going to start first with the magic ring and then we're going to do six single crochet into the magic ring so we're going to do one two three four five six okay and then we're going to close the gap okay I'm gonna place my marker over here so in the second row we are going to increase in each and every stitch for a total of 12 stitches in the second row so you're going to go in the first stitch do two single crochet in the same in the same stitch okay so you're going to do the same thing in the next stitch do it to single crochet again okay so you're going to continue increasing all the way around until the end Okay, so after that, uh, in our third row, we're going to do single crochet, then increase in the next stitch and repeat the same pattern all the way around until the end for a total of 18 stitches. So you're going to do single crochet, then increase in the next stitch. Okay, and then you're going to repeat that all around. So single crochet, increase, single crochet, increase all the way around until the end. So after that, uh, in our next row, which is our fourth row, we're going to do single crochet in the next two stitches, then increase and repeat the same pattern six times for a total of 24 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet, single crochet, and then increase. In the next stitch okay and then you're going to repeat that see uh, an other five more times so you're going to do two single crochet increase two single crochet increase all the way around okay so after that uh, in our fifth row we're going to do three single crochet then increase and then do again three single crochet increase and repeat all the way around for a total of 30 stitches so we're going to do one, two, three, single crochet, then increase in the next stitch. Okay, and then you're going to repeat that all the way around until the end here for a total of 30 stitches. Okay, so after that, uh, in our sixth row, we are going to do four single crochet then increase and repeat the same pattern all around six times for a total of 36 stitches. So we're going to do single crochet, one, two, three, four, and then increase. Okay, and then repeat that again all the way around until the end. Okay, so after you're done with your row six, in our row seven, we're going to do single crochet all the way across until the end for a total of 36 single crochets. So I'll see you when you're done with your seventh row so that we do the eighth row together. Okay, so after that, uh, in our eighth row, we are going to do five single crochet, then increase and repeat that six times for a total of 42 stitches so we're going to do one two three 
four, five, and then increase in the next stitch. Okay, and then you're going to repeat that five more times all the way around until the end. So when you're done with your eight, with this the eighth row, from our ninth row until our fourteenth row, we're going to do a single crochet all the way around in each row for a total of forty-two stitches in each row. So I'll see you when you're done with your fourteenth row, so that we do the fifteenth row together. Okay, so after the 14th row, in the 15th row, we are going to start decreasing and uh, we're going to do five single crochet, then decrease and repeat all the way around for a total of 36 stitches. So we're going to do one, two, three, four, five and then decrease in the next two stitches so you're going to go in the front loop of the of the next stitch pull through and go in the front loop of the next stitch pull through and then pull through all the three loops together okay so you're going to repeat that again five more times so you're going to do five single crochet decrease all the way around until the end okay so after that uh, in our 16th row we are going to do four single crochet then decrease and repeat all the way around for a total of 30 stitches. So we're going to do one, two, three, four, and then decrease in the next stitches, in the next two stitches. Okay, and then you're going to repeat that again all the way around until the end. Okay, so in our 17th row, uh, we're going to do three single crochet, then decrease and repeat all the way around six times for a total of uh, 24 stitches. So we're going to do one, two, Three single crochet then decrease in the next two stitches okay and then you're going to repeat that all the way around so three single crochet decrease all the way around until the end okay so after you're done with that uh, in our row 18 we are going to do two single crochet decrease and repeat all the way around for a total of 18 stitches so we're going to do one two and then decrease in the next two stitches okay and then repeat that all the way around until the end after you're done with that uh, in our 19th row which is our last row we are going to do um, single crochet then decrease single crochet decrease all the way around for a total of 12 stitches so you're going to do single crochet and then decrease in the next two stitches okay and then you're going to repeat that all the way around so single crochet decrease all the way around until the end so when you're done with that you're going to cut off your yarn and leave long enough for sewing and also make sure to stuff your head completely when you're done with that and then I'll show you how to do to make the legs at the body together okay so making the legs is quite easy so what you do is you start with the magic ring and then you do uh, three other three rows of single crochet all the way around for a total of six single crochet in each row so I already did that so make sure you make two legs so that we join the two together and when you're done with the last leg please don't cut off the yarn so that we start uh, joining the two together okay so now I'll show you how to join the two legs together so we're going to do a chain four so we're going to do one two three four okay so after you do a chain four 
we are going to go to the next leg over here so where we left off and uh here we're going to start where we left off at the last stitch and then we're going to slip stitch over there okay so after we slip stitch then i'm going to pick uh to take my marker and then i'm going to put it over here so that i know where to start uh in the next row okay so after that we're going to do single crochet in the first leg so we have a uh, six single crochet in the first leg so we're going to do single crochet and then also single crochet in the next one okay so do six single crochet until you get here where we have joined okay so after you do your six single crochet in the first leg we are going to do sing single crochet in each of the next four chains that we joined here okay so we're going to do single crochet one and then the next chain two do single crochet two also in the same thing you do single crochet three and in the last chain we do single crochet Okay, and then after that, uh, in our next leg also, we are going to do six single crochet. Okay, so we're going to do one. Okay, so repeat, do six single crochet in the second leg until you get here where we joined with the chain. Okay, so after you get on, after you get on this other side of the chain, we are going to do single crochet in each and every chain. So for a total of four single crochet in this chain okay so we're going to go in the first chain and do single crochet one okay in the next chain two we're going to do a single crochet okay do the same in the next chain in the chain three And in the last chain, we do single crochet two. Okay. Okay, so after you finish with that, uh, this is where we started. So I'm going to take off my marker and put it over here. Okay, so when you're done with that, uh, in the next uh, we're going to do two single crochet increase two single crochet increase all the way around until we have two stitches left here at the end okay so we're going to do one two and then increase in the next stitch Okay, and then you're going to repeat that again five more times so two single crochet increase until you have two stitches left here at the end so I'll see you when you finish with that and then I'll show you how to do the last two stitches okay so after you get here at the end we have two stitches left so you're going to do single crochet in each stitch so single crochet and then single crochet Okay, so we have a total of 26 stitches in that row. Okay, so after that, uh, in our next row, from row 3 until row 8, which is... So for the next 6 rows, we are going to do single crochet in each row for a total of 26 stitches in each row. So I'll see you when you're done with your 8th row, so that I show you how to do the ninth row. Okay, so after we're done with row 8, uh, we're going to start with our row 9 and in our row 9 we're going to start decreasing 
so we're going to do six single crochet first so we're going to do one two three four five six and then we're going to decrease decrease in the next two stitches okay after that next you're going to do seven single crochet so do seven single crochet so you're going to do one two okay so continue until you have seven single crochets Okay, so after the seven single crochets, we're going to decrease again. Okay, and then after that, we're going to do another seven single crochet, then decrease. So you're going to do seven single crochet over here and decrease at the end. So we'll have a total of 23 stitches in this row. Okay, so after that, uh, in our next row, which is our 10th row, we are going to do two single crochet decrease and repeat that five times until we have two stitches uh, i mean three stitches left here at the end okay so we're going to do one two and then decrease in the next stitch okay so you're going to repeat that again four more times and then we'll have three stitches left here at the end so i'll see you when you're done with that and then i'll show you how to do the last three stitches okay so after you're done with that in the last three stitches we're going to do single crochet in each stitch so we're going to do single crochet single crochet and then single crochet in the last stitch okay so now in our 11th row which is our last row we're going to do single crochet decrease single crochet decrease all the way around six times for a total of 12 stitches so we're going to do single crochet and then decrease in the next stitch okay and then you're going to repeat that all the way around so single crochet decrease all the way around until the end so when you're done with that, uh, fill, your, fill your body up so that it's fully stuffed and then cut off your yarn and leave it long enough for sewing. And then after that, I'll show you how to make the ears. Okay, so for the ears, we're going to start with the magic ring and then we're going to do five single crochet into the magic ring. So we're going to do one. two three four five okay so after that uh in our second row we're going to do a moment Okay, so in our second row we're going to do single crochet then increase single crochet increase all the way around until the end so and then we have a, a single crochet left over here so we do single crochet and then increase in the next stitch And then repeat that again so single crochet increase okay and then we have single crochet left over here so you're just going to do single crochet in the last stitch so we'll have a total of eight stitches in that row Okay, so after that, uh, in our third row, we are going to do two single crochet, increase two single crochet, 
increase and single crochet in the last stitch and then we have a total of 10 stitches so we're going to do single uh two single crochet so one two and then increase in the next stitch Okay, so repeat that one more time and then do single crochet in the last stitch okay so after that uh, in our fourth row we are going to do three single crochet then increase and repeat that uh, two times and then single crochet in the last stitch for a total of 12 stitches so we're going to do single crochet one Two, three, and then increase in the next stitch. Okay, and then repeat that one more time, and then do single crochet in the last stitch. Okay, so after that, uh, in our fifth row, we are going to do four single crochet, increase and repeat two times, and then do single crochet in the last stitch. For a total of 14 stitches so we're going to do single crochet one two three four and then increase in the next stitch okay so repeat that one more time and then do single crochet in the last stitch okay so after you're done with that now in our next uh, th uh seven rows in our next seventh rows which is from row six until row 12 you're going to do single crochet all the way around in each stitch uh in each row for a total of 14 stitches in each row so you'll have a total of seven rows your ear should look like this when you're done until row 12 okay so after that i'll show you how to do the arms so the arms are quite easy so basically what you do is you start with the magic ring and then do five single crochet into the magic ring and then after that from row two until row nine you're going to do a single crochet in each row for a total of five stitches in each row so do uh nine rows of single crochets for the arms and make two so after that i'll show you how to make the heart the little heart okay so for the little heart we're going to start with the magic ring first so we're going to do magic ring and then we're going to do chain three so we're going to do one two three and uh we're going to work all the stitches into the into the magic ring so after you do your chain three we're going to do two treble into the ring so we're going to do treble crochet treble stitch one and then do another treble into the magic ring okay so after that uh, we're going to do three double crochet again into the magic ring so we're going to do one double crochet then do another double crochet two and then do the last double crochet three okay and then after that we're going to do a chain one and then we're going to do one treble into the magic ring again
okay after that uh we're going to do again a chain one and then after the chain one we're going to do three double crochet into the ring so we're going to do one two and three okay after that we're going to do two treble two treble stitches then do another treble Okay, and then we're going to do a chain three so one two three okay and then uh, we're going to pull through our yarn so you're going to pull the yarn like that to close the center and then over here we're going to do to slip stitch at the center inside the okay and then after that just going to cut off your yarn okay and there we have our little heart so we're going to attach this one here at the center of the body we're just going to stitch it at the center part Okay, so after that I'll show you how to join all the parts together okay guys so I finished attaching the parts together so for the ears I attached them between the second and the third row so in uh, in the second and the fourth row which is three rows okay and then also for the I embroidered the mouth or the nose and also you're going to attach the the hands in line with the ears so make sure they lay in line with each other same case with this other side and also I embroidered the little eyebrows over here okay and for the larve you're going to attach the arms first okay so separately and attach the heart also separately here at the center of the belly and then after that you're going to attach uh, the arms together here with the heart and also I made a little bit a little bow tie here so I made just a chain long enough uh, to tie it around as you can see so this is how it looks like so guys I hope you enjoyed this pattern if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe and check out my other videos so I upload uh, one or two videos every week so please subscribe thank you until next time bye